here to congratulate the champion and reserve champion of the EMO Insurance USHJA 3 foot 3 jumping seat medal finals West. Congratulations to Nicole McMillian and uh, second is to Charlotte Murray and her tra their trainers are with them James, Hags James Hagman or Jim and Jenny Brown. So the first question I would ask of you is, what was it like, the experience? This is a stepping stone to what was tested before earlier with the um, talent search. And I'm wondering uh, what you thought of how this medal final is, the different phases and, and what you learned from it. Okay, I'm Nicole McMillian, and um, I really love this medal. I think it's um, a great stepping stone to the USCT. Um, I think all three phases <clears throat> are also great. The first phase, I think it's nice to start with the flat phase, just kind of calm your nerves a little bit um, and just go in with a calm mindset. And then I think the gymnastics phase is also really fun. I think that was probably my favorite part. Um, and I love the fact that we get to watch the USCT before the jumping seat as well. Um, I think it's just all around a great class. So I agree mostly with Nicole. I love this class and I've been doing it forever. And one of my favorite parts about it is how in the gymnastics phase we got to ride a lot of similar tracks than the USCT did. Like we got to do three to the one to the three and the same rollbacks, practically everything backwards. So it was fun to be able to do this class as a preparation for next year, if my trainer lets me do it. <laughs> Saying your age and tell us a little bit about your horse, and then we'll ask a question of the trainers. Um, so I'm 15. Um, I ride as 14 this year. Um, Loverboy is my friend's horse that I've been leasing um, just for medal finals. Um, he's an amazing horse. He's one of the funnest horses I've ever gotten to ride. I'm 17 and I ride as 16. And my horse, his name is Great Blue, we call him Bo. And we imported him a little bit over a year ago. It was actually, this show last year was his first show with us and he was just, how far he's come since then to now is amazing. And he's gotten so brave and he's so confident in himself and I just love him, he's the best. <laughs> okay, so I'd like to ask each of the trainers about your feelings on how this is still a fairly new uh, medal. It's only you know been a few years and how you feel about the stepping stone of this and is it leading riders to the next step? Um, I'm Jim Hagman. Um, I'm particularly fond of this class. I think it's extremely important for our industry. I wish we'd had it 20 years ago, but here we have it. Um, the Blenheim Group do you know, the best job in the United States, for sure, probably in the, literally in the world with the championships, just incredible. Um, giving the riders, oh. and you know, we've, our program brings them up from the roots, an opportunity to grow step by step and in the process and give horses a chance that aren't show jumping, you know, talent search finalist horses, but have the ability to give you a lot of experience and a good positive growth step to the uh, jumping seat. It's just the whole, all the components of it really, really are fabulous. And um, I want to congratulate both of the kids. Um, they're both wonderful riders, wonderful kids. And Jenny Brown's an exceptional teacher. Um, did Rachel have a baby? I think she's a yeah, so, Um Nicole's primary instructor, uh, Rachel Cummer on Hallwalt is her name, but that's her married name. I knew her as a junior. She was a junior with us. She is our managing head instructor and partner at Orange County uh, program. And Nicole lives in Huntington Beach, so it's quite a drive to Elvin Star. So Rachel is in labor as we speak. Oh, wow. And um, so congratulations to Matt and Rachel. And uh, you know, this is an opportunity, wonderful opportunity that the Link family provided to Nicole to lease Loverboy, because Haley just started it. Colorado, and um, yes, he's a he was an ex show jumper. We found out the show jumping in Florida a couple of winters ago, so it worked out very well. Hello, I'm Jenny Brown, and uh, really proud of the girls. They did a great job. It was an amazing competition. We really enjoyed the qualifying classes for this all year. They added the flat phase in uh, to the qualifying this year, and I thought that was really helpful for the riding and being able to go in the jumper ring. We often get to go in the Grand Prix field and in the big rings at all the horse shows, and it's such great experience being within the time allowed, the jumper jumps, helping the horse to be clean and careful and efficient. 
Um, and the championships was beautiful. It was so nice to be at this venue. The management did a great job. Flat phase was tough. It was hard. Kids really had to ride. The gymnastics was super. And then a beautiful course out here on the Grand Prix field really tested everyone. I thought that for some of the kids coming up, they could really get some great experience and learn from it, but that it was hard enough and challenging enough that the kids who were at the top could really shine and did a great job. And I'm really proud of her. And it was fun to have a work off. After all that, I didn't really think we'd be that close within three points, but it made it very suspenseful and a great competition. So thank you to Blenheim and USHA and EMO. <laughs> Good job.